Where are you from? Otaragay. I'm from Pretoria. You're from Pretoria? Yes, sir. Yes, man of God. You must pray. Amen. I'm seeing cancer in the bloodline. You must pray. Okay. Okay, man of God. And fight cancer in the bloodline. You must check in the family. There's a lot of people that passed on because their legs were swollen. Okay, this is cancer. Okay. okay. Some of them they thought that the person have matched on witchcraft. It's cancers. Call your people and check in the black okay. Okay, So the reason I'm telling you we want to prevent it before you come. Okay. That's our work. Do you understand? If I come and tell you you eat muesli in the morning, what good will it do? After I told you that you ate muesli in the morning, cancer will still come. And you will ask yourself, I went to a prophet, he did not pick it up. Okay? So we need to fight it now. Okay? Your words change things in the spirit. Amen. Don't stop declaring. Okay? Don't stop declaring. Don't stop declaring. You see how small she is? She will move mountains with her words. And this cancer they want to put, they want to put it in the womb. Huh? It's my wife, she's always having pain. She's your wife? Yes. She's always having pain in the womb. In the womb. Every time she wants to, to conceive, there's a pain, a huge blood comes. There's a huge blood that is coming. Correct. You see what I'm talking about? Huh? You see what I'm talking about? It's this cancer that is trying to develop in the womb. But don't worry. Amen. Okay? Amen. I, I see two children coming. Amen. 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 The boy is Moses. 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 So you see, very soon you people will come, you will be playing with the baby. Very soon. Okay. Very soon. You understand? Prophet must go to the root of the problem. So we can uproot it. They've not been understanding why the womb is always painful. When she wants to conceive, blood come out. Was this problem? For the past three years. Huh? For the past three years. For the past three years. Yes. The same thing all the time. Yes. Don't worry. Moses is coming. Amen. Amen. Glory to Jesus. Greetings in the wonderful name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Mama, can you please tell us your name and where you're coming from? Uh, my name is Katlejo Ngobeni. I come from Pretoria. Uh, Mama, you received the word of prophecy today. And what was the word of prophecy from the man of God today? Uh, man of God said that um, he sees that whenever that I speak something in the atmosphere, the heavens open and that... Um, uh, he sees in my bloodlines people are suffering with cancers and if ever then you, I'm not praying, I can be affected there and there, but it shall never happen. And how would you like to confirm the word of prophecy that you received from the man of God to be true? Yeah, normally when I say things to people or I pray for people by God's grace, I'm a wife pastors, then things come to, to pass and again, there are times whereby sometimes I feel pain there in my in my body then just uh, but I've went to doctors but they've never confirmed that they've seen anything but so far it was true that whatever that she was saying what word of advice do you have for the viewers um, the word of advice is that we live in the prophet and it shall come to pass because God sends a man of God as a man who sees and whatever that he says, if ever you believe, nothing shall never happen. If ever you hold on to him, 
it shall never happen. And I thank the man of God for the prophecy because it's what was in my heart um, and God helped everything to open up everything for me. And thank you so much, man of God.